This is the daily video update for Wednesday, December 8th, 2021 for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. It's been a couple weeks since we've done this, but I want to take a moment and provide a brief update on where we are uh, with the COVID-19 pandemic and our response to it as a congregation. To back up a little ways, uh, we announced our last big change to our COVID protocols on November 10th, about a month ago. The current plans are available on our website at unitarianlincoln.org slash reentry. And in that update, we started transitioning our reentry plan from an understanding of COVID-19 as a pandemic to uh, an endemic issue that we're going to have to live with for some time. The question is not how do we solve this thing, but how do we adapt our work at church to meet the ongoing needs of our context? What that means, practically, is that we said that we would try to keep the church building open as much as we can going forward with the condition that people wear masks and be vaccinated in order to participate in in in-person events. That's where we were a month ago and that's still the current plan. So right now, as of yesterday, the health department announced that we are in high orange on the COVID-19 risk dial. This graph is what the seven day rolling average of new COVID cases in Lancaster County looks like right now. So as you can see, there's been a rolling increase over the last month or two, followed by a very sharp uptick over the last week. Now, our priority is to keep the church building open and to hold all of our December events with in-person options. I'm going to talk to the board tonight at a previously scheduled meeting to work through what that means if cases continue to rise and we go to red on the risk dial. If we change our plans, we'll let you know. But I'll also tell you what I told our staff on Tuesday. This plan that we put into place a month ago keeps the building open, but it depends on each of us to do our own assessment of what level of risk we are comfortable with. If you look at the numbers right now out in our community and and it feels prudent to stay home and participate in the life of the church remotely, then stay home and participate in the life of the church remotely. We spent a lot of time and effort and resources making sure that we have robust multi-platform and live streaming programs and, and capacity exactly for this reason, exactly so that we could present that option. So for right now, our intention is to hold the worship service and congregational meeting here at 6300 A Street on Sunday, both in person and with a live streaming option and to continue that way indefinitely. Now, it is possible that we will change this again as the situation evolves, especially if cases keep going up the way they have in the last week or two. But if that happens, then we will communicate with you, the members of this congregation, every step of the way. All right. We'll put this uh, out on Facebook and, uh, and through... Uh, as many channels as we can. We'll be back with a uh, regularly scheduled update tomorrow uh, and again on Friday. Until then, have a great afternoon, and I will see you soon.